So continuing our home medicine series, here to talk about diuretics. The three most common diuretics I see, here they are. Lasix, brand name, generic is furosemide. The second, hydrochlorothiazide. The third, Boomex. Boomex. So you got Lasix, Boomex hydrochlorothiazide and I these meds I see very commonly um now here's a way to remember them Lasix and Boomex Lasix and Boomex Lasix and Boomex both have five letters in them and they're both end the same way Lasix and Boomex it will end the kind of the same way if you say it like that I mean alright now the way to remember hydrochlorothiazide is a diuretic Hydro is right in the name. Hydro is water, right in the name. Okay, now, thinking about hydrochlorothiazide, it also can be used to control blood pressure as well. Okay, another thing there, it can be used to control blood pressure. I've had patients who are on hydrochlorothiazide and I say, oh, do you have, you know, congestive heart failure, heart failure, and they go, no. I, uh, but I do have high blood pressure. Okay, now I know why you're on it. Okay, thank you for your information. Okay? So, learn these meds cold. Lasix, Boomex, hydrochlorothiazide are diuretics. A pearl here about diuretics. What they do, why are they, why are patients even on them? They're called, you know, water pills. Okay? So, the patients have fluid in the wrong places. They probably have congestive heart failure. And they either have fluid backing up in the base of their lungs, or they have fluid in their legs, depending on right or left side heart failure, okay? Now, with this, electrolytes also get lost. I bet you, if your patient's on a diuretic, their doctor also prescribes them potassium. So potassium doesn't get low, which can be a very bad outcome for your patient, okay? Potassium supplements are very common in patients who are on diuretics. So here we go. Lasix, Boomex, Lasix, Boomex. Go together. Don't forget the long, crazy name, hydrochlorothiazide. Top three diuretics you need to know. See you next time.